and to fight Treasure Knight. What's the matter, Plague Knight? Alchemy business slowing down. Here, to make some coin. Or are the Order's coffers running dry? Can't you just synthesize all the fool's gold you want? <laughs> Good guess, but no, it's something far more important than mere gold. More important than gold? Now you're just being ridiculous. Get out of here, you bottom feeder. Ooh, your essence is showing. <laughs> I hope you don't mind if I help myself. <laughs> yeah, interesting conversation among them, huh? Ah, that I wasn't expecting. But, honestly, I find Treasure Knight to be even easier. I'm sure you do still take hits every now and then, but because of how much he really doesn't move... It's easy to take him out! It's kinda cool seeing how different the bosses can be with different characters. I like it. But Treasure Knight's essence is now ours. You look like you lost a fight with a pond. Ocean, actually. I had to go liberate the essence of Avarice. It's a nice place you've got down there. I never understood what he saw in gold. You can just make it from sawdust and mouse skulls. <laughs> oh, that's a little dark. <laughs> some people do things the hard way. <laughs> Let's do some work. So, what are we working on? Well, I don't really have anything, and I don't have enough cipher coins still. That's it then? Huh. Well, safe travels out there. But I do have enough cipher coins to fix that uh, catapult Percy's working on. But first, we should probably go back to the Explodatorium. Just because we still need to give that alchemy coin away. So once I find the location, I'll cut to there. See you in a bit! Well, I kind of got lost, but <laughs> I'll be sure to double check to see where I'm supposed to go again because I honestly don't remember. It's, it seems for it. I don't understand why I don't remember. You think it'd be easy to remember. You went there because it's the same place Chester always is. But the treasure showed up for us, so I'm going to make use of that. And by make use of it, it just dump it all over the place. easy to obtain. Oh, you can stand on them. Good to know. Oh, the more money I can get, the better. It'll help show off the stuff later. At least you don't have to be too selective with Plague Knight's playstyle. Just because of his double jump. And having that float and his burst jump. And the vast! Hmm. Nothing really of use here for me. And just money. Money galore. And leave. <laughs> Why not? Okay, now if you will give me a moment, I'm gonna go figure out where in the world Chester is an exploratorium. I still can't believe I don't remember. Well, I sure feel like a dummy. I know where it is. I'll be right back once I get there. Okay, so I I glitched the game again. That is very entertaining to me too. <laughs> I forgot that you can destroy this wall. Oh, I feel like such a dummy. I don't know why I keep forgetting that. And you can go away right quickly. There we go. So, the lovely little item we get from Chester here... ...is the Staff of Surging. Rise into the air with a surging attack. So... <laughs> I may as well show this off. Ever seen the Shoryuken? 
like that. It's helpful if you'd like to get close range and personal, but it's not really one of my fortes. I know, a close range platformer doesn't like the close range attack. Strange, isn't it? Anyways, I will meet you guys back on the map, because if I do not clear this stage, I do not get to keep the relic. So I'll see you soon. Okay, I got it. I died in the process, but I got it. Uh, well, since we have those cypher coins, let's finally put them to use. Okay, um... I'm gonna talk to Percy here. He says the same thing, and for 50 cypher coins? Excellent! I'll s end for that part. We'll be soaring in no time! Take the blast. Perfect, now that's one beautiful ter person rot. Hop aboard, and the spoils are as good as ours. Well, let's make sure we don't end up in the ocean. Well, it's not the ocean. It's Plague Knight. Now's our chance. Everyone, get him! Uh, Percy couldn't hit the broadside of a barn. <laughs> You're cornered! Lay down your chemical weapons and come quietly! <laughs> Quiet, he says! Total silence! Boom! <laughs> you are being a royal pain in the butt! I won't let you take me that easily. Oh, there's a gold one here. Well, what do you know? Victory for Plague Knight, though! <laughs> Everyone knows the bomb is mightier than the sword! <laughs> Minions, join me! The armor outpost is ours! Whoa! <laughs> You hearing that rumble? It's the aerial anvil! It looks like a full load of cowards! <laughs> Let's take their things! Alright, so now we can actually... That was weird. Traverse the armor outpost properly. And let's start by talking to this trouble out... Acolyte. Hello, bird person. All hail the Trowpool King. Who? You've never heard of the Trowpool King? Half trout, half apple. Oh, and he gets quite upset if you say it like Trowpool. He doesn't s need troops. It's more like council or doubtful. If you ever visit his grotto, hold your chalice aloft. The Trowpool King will appear and bless you with a sacred dance. Dance? That's what Mona was doing earlier. <laughs> Maybe he could show me how? As it happens, I have been entrusted to sell trouble chalices to believers. Would you like one? Yes. So much yes! <laughs> a vessel for strong, uh, storing mythical ichor. But where to find it? So we should be able to see the trouble now. And if you ever missed any items... Psst. Hey, green guy. I'm loaded with deals that'll blow you away. Why not have a look? Sure. Oh, look at that. Bag of tonic holds up to 10 health tonics. And if you ever do miss an item, just like uh, with Shovel Knight's uh, adventure, you can always talk to Chester and he usually will carry it on him. But I would gladly purchase this, because now we can carry up to 5 health tonics on- er, not 5, 10 health tonics. Wow, I can't talk. The chicken? <laughs> <laughs> if they're not cowards, they're chickens! I'm a rooster, sir, and I've invested in half the town. Do as you must, but I'm unflappable. Wow. So he owns half the town. Well, 
let us take care of this young sir. Ah, so you're the one who's scaring off all my customers. It's enough to make a harp haberdasher flip his lid. <laughs> do you do huts? I could use a blast-proof lining on mine. <laughs> you miscreant! Huds? That's not even a proper hat! No structure, no support! No flare! Hats are a waste of felt, old man. They all f they fall off in the wind. Hoods are objectively more op- Utilitarian? Oh, utilitarian! I think. I don't know that word, I'm sorry. How, how dare you, sir! I demand satisfaction! Have at you! And yeah, we still get to fight him. Of course, with the range we get, and having health potions on us, of course, and he does have an invulnerability period. Plates? Silverware? And my R button pressing is not taking effect! Back to this one, huh? Oh! Yeah, let's not die so quickly! There we go. Good thing I was paying attention to my health. <laughs> wow, for a geezer, you sure put up a fight! How'd you get all these moves? Oh, uh, well, my hats aren't mere fashion accessories. Each one bestows great power upon me. Wow, powers? I'll take ten of your finest hats then! Sadly, the powers are unique to yours truly. They'd only make you look powerful and classy. Oh, blast! Well, <laughs> I see you later then! Indeed. <laughs> and yeah, that's how we get the music sheet. Oh, I've completely lost track for how long I've been recording, but holy cow, did I take a beating! Well, at least when you leave town, you get your health back. But I think we deserve one more stop, don't you? Let's head to the Truffle Pond. Now, before I do anything, whenever you hit down, you know how you get a little bit of a crouchy dance. Who has awakened me? Mortal, dost thou need... Wait a tick. Alchemist! News of thy villainy has reached the Trouple Pond. Be gone from the sacred grotto. But, um, my liege! <laughs> I've actually come to learn to, to dance! See, I only sort of twitch. Oh, he's actually twitching! <laughs> oh, that's cute! Enough, disgraceful. Where is the motion? Where is the passion? Thou needs a miracle. Wilt thou receive the gift of rhythm, humble alchemist? Of course! As it so happens, we are miracle workers. No one is without hope. Places, everyone! Ooh. A waltz! And that's how it is done. A true dancer holds down to practice. I shall grant you my icors, but only for noble causes. Oh, ah, uh, <laughs> certainly. Noble is my middle name. <laughs> I still require a nominal repentance fee for proper satisfaction. Sanctification. Now, choose your icor wisely. And yes, this is actually where we get our 
armor. Or cloaks in this matter. There is one I like to use, and that is the treasure trappings. Magnetizes treasure when you charge. Drop half as much gold when you fall in battle. Which is super nice. There's also the goo garnet garment. Bounce off walls when bomb jumping. Maybe tough to control. Wardrobe. Heavenly planted. Keep your footing when struck by enemies, but stopping may be a problem. I already slide enough. And this one? Dandy duds. Flashy armor that increases jubilance by 200%. So it's like the gold armor for Shovel Knight. Just fancy stuff. But this is usually the one I like to go with, because if I lose my treasure, <laughs> it makes things difficult later on. <laughs> yeah! Keep thy beak clean, O oh plagued one. Return if thou hast further need of my blessing. But yeah, and we can still duck, but if we hold down the down key, he starts dancing! So he's, oh, there we go. At least you don't fall off the edge. That was my main concern when I first did that. But look at this dancing sprite! It's so well done! Practices just for the girl he likes. <laughs> And I want to show off one more thing as well before I end this off. If you actually try dancing in front of Mona, he does this! He's like, oh my gosh, she's so shy! <laughs> I thought this was a really nice touch! But we still have music sheets to give away, so let's go talk to Percy. <sighs> okay. And we got some new songs. Why do I even put up with this simpleton? Hey, Ulan. What new songs do we have? Disturbing the Peace? <laughs> and just that one. Not many new songs. And what do you have to say, Baz? Hey, boss, I swiped these potions from the Magicist. Oh, he got more for us. Cool. And he maxed us out, too, which is super helpful. Thank goodness. Oh boy. But yeah, like, if you're anywhere else in the, um... I've already forgotten the name of the lair here. He'll dance, but the moment you're in front of Mona, he just refuses, and I love that touch! It's just, it's so simple, but it's perfect! <laughs> it shows who he likes! <laughs> but, I believe with that, I'm gonna stop here. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Shovel Knight Plague of Shadows! This is Autumn Child saying, I'll see you all next time. <laughs>